Welcome to the next video of our complete engine rebuild guide. In this episode, we are removing the crankshaft. In today's video, we will take a look at what tools we need to complete this job, a step-by-step -step guide on how to complete it, and in the end, we will do a hardware roundup to make sure that we do not lose any of our precious hardware. To make following the content easier, you can pause this video at any moment. That said, let's take a look at what tools we need. For this job, we need an engine case splitting tool. This tool can be used on most late 60s, 70s, 80s, 90s Vespa large frame engines. We also need this piece as it helps us push apart the case from the crankshaft. We also use a round shafted screwdriver to crank down on the tool. And if you do want to reuse your crankshaft, never ever ever use a hammer. The reason is, both crankshaft halves are connected at the bottom of the connecting rod. That means there is no axle through the middle. Meaning if you apply axial force, you risk it squishing or twisting the crankshaft. Thus whacking it out of round and balance. So don't use a hammer. With our tools ready, let's take a look at the step-by-step -step guide on how to get this job done. In order to remove the crankshaft, we need to press it out from the clutch side of the engine. Use the three clutch cover bolt holes to attach the engine splitting tool to the engine. By being attached to the engine, we can use the tool to press out the crankshaft. By tightening down this push bolt, the crankshaft will be pushed out from the bearing seat. You will see the gap between the crankshaft and the engine case increase. Once the crankshaft is out, remove it and remove the engine splitting tool. Before we put away the hardware, let's make sure we have everything. At the end of this job, we are left with one crankshaft and on the crankshaft are two Woodruff keys. If you do decide to use a different crankshaft, you can remove the Woodruff keys and reuse them in the new crankshaft. If they're stuck, don't bother, just replace them with new ones. Thank you for watching. Click here to get to the next video in this series. Don't forget to comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. And if you like this, you can support us on Patreon. The link is in the description down below. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video.